if you're from africa then you need to watch this video this province in canada is organizing a virtual immigration fair for africans guys this is amazing you have the opportunities to be interviewed by employers and you can land yourself a job in canada so sit back relax grab a popcorn because i'm gonna be walking you through the process guys welcome back to my channel it's your beautiful baby girl kemzi o if you're seeing this beautiful face for the very first time you're welcome in my channel i talk about relocation tips life abroad and faith and if you're a returning subscriber you guys are always the best thank you for watching my videos back to back thank you for liking sharing you know i am grateful for your love and your support before we go on guys please i want to beg you to kindly subscribe to this channel guys if you are not subscribing you're missing out a lot then like my videos guys a lot of you watch my videos and you're not even liking it please eh because edger like my videos share it to everyone around you and don't forget to turn on your notification bell so that whenever i drop a new video you will be notified and you can watch the videos all right now let's get straight into the business of today as you can see from the thumbnail okay this province in canada is recruiting africans in fact they are organizing a virtual international job fair for africans and is open to all professions okay so don't think it's restricted to a particular profession i'm going to be taking you through how you can go about it okay we all know that canada has 10 provinces and three territories if you are familiar with most of my videos about canada i've been able to state all the provinces and guys there are a lot of opportunities for each province in fact if i start taking the province one by one and you know making a video on them trust me for the next three four months i will just keep you know dropping videos about just canada because these provinces in canada they have so many opportunities there are several parts where in fact canada is one of the countries that has numerous pathways for immigrants if i should start listing them guys we will not live here today there are several reasons why canada is one of the top choice for most immigrants if i ask one two three of you which country would you like to migrate to in fact if i do a survey most people would choose canada the reasons are not far-fetched number one there is high quality of life in canada there are a lot of employment opportunities and career development you've got publicly funded health care there is is free public school and subsidized higher education for pr and citizens you've got diversity and multiculturalism canada is one of the countries that is big on diversity guys there are a lot of nationals that live in canada you'll be shocked it's a multicultural community or environment it is safe it is peaceful you have access to social services and there are a lot of benefits of becoming a canada permanent residence or citizens guys i can keep going on and on all right so there's so many benefits of living in canada as an immigrant all right so guys there's what we call atlantic canada or better still atlantic provinces and they're on the eastern part of canada they comprises of new brunswick newfoundland and labrador nova scotia and prince edward island this atlantic provinces is becoming one of the popular destination for most immigrants the reasons are not far-fetched it is very affordable if you're looking for you know a cheap place to live in canada just target the atlantic provinces okay the educational system is top-notch they also have several immigration programs you have the atlantic immigration program there are so many of them guys for the atlantic provinces each of them they have their specific streams that they organize but for the purpose of this video i've come bearing good news guys one of the atlantic provinces is currently organizing a virtual immigration fair for africans and guys this fair will come up on 25th of october 2023 when i heard about this i was like my people need to hear this this opportunity must not pass us by for those that want to migrate to canada i'm going to be walking you through the process i will explain how you can apply then i'll be putting the 
link in the description box so when you go to the description box just click the link apply and that is it this is irrespective of your profession no matter what you studied in school or what you are qualified to do please apply as long as you've written a canada stout cv guys i keep telling you you're going to be uploading your cv so make sure you tailor your cv to a canada stout format i did a video on how to do this i'm going to be putting link in the description box and if you want me to help you review your cv i offer such services all the services i offer is in the description box guys i don't want you to miss out on this so the province that is organizing this immigration job fair is newfoundland and labrada i'll be taking you guys to my screen now so i'll explain how you will go about it come with me and let's go to my screen so this is the page guys it says newfoundland and labrada canada it is one of the atlantic provinces in canada and as you can see it's the immigration virtual fair it means you're going to be interviewed virtually online that's what it means by virtual fair okay and as you can see also that this is for africa so virtual immigration fair africa and it's going to take place on the 25th of october 2023 so this is how you're going to register but before then why should we attend this fair you attend so that you can receive direct access to employers hiring in your field you know i said irrespective of your occupation or your field or what you're qualified for you are eligible to apply then you can network with employers this is the best time to put forward your skills your experience you need to be able to prove to the employer that you know what you're doing you're qualified for this role you're eligible for this role guys i'm very big on cv and interviews so i always like people to prepare themselves so before that day make sure you prepare yourself all right now it says upload your resume which employers can review you know i keep telling you in most of my videos you might not be there sometimes to tell the employer that oh you can do this you can do that you have have the skill your cv is your marketing tool if you have a bad cv there's no how you will get that job so i offer that services guys if you want me to help you review your cv just chat me on instagram or click the link in the description box i can help you review your cv so make sure your cv is tailored in a canadian style format and is top notch okay then you attend a live immigration program information section you can ask your questions directly to the immigration officer you will learn about the steps to immigrate to newfoundland and labrador like i said most provinces in canada in fact all provinces in canada they have their own specific or unique immigration stream so when you've gotten a job offer with this province they will guide you on how you can you know proceed how you can do your application then you also learn about what it is like to live in this province newfoundland and labrador in terms of the cost of living the lifestyle the jobs the salary the population size and much more so guys it's pretty much like an holistic approach it's a only one approach where they will guide you not only you getting the job or meeting with the employer they will also guide you on the province what would you likely expect from this province okay so i feel it's a very good one and it's for africans now let's quickly look at how we can apply so i'm going to be putting the link in the description box take your time read it read about i don't want to start reading everything because it's going to make this video unnecessarily long read about everything go to the home page why attend the event the about the frequently ask questions everything is there okay how do i register how do i log in on the day i've registered for the seminar but i've forgotten my login details do i need to download any software everything is explained in this video so i don't want to make it long and guys i want to tell you you can migrate with your family canada is a family friendly country no matter the route you want to immigrate to canada with you are allowed to take your family which include your spouse and your children so all the frequently asked question is there guys take your time to read through it but for the purpose of this video we just want to quickly go to how we can apply so what you have to do is click register now so guys when you click register it's going to take you to this page it says attendee registration form guys this form is very easy this is one of the easiest form i've seen so far okay it's not a complex application at all as you can see it's just a one page form then you submit all right now the first thing is asking is your first name which is your personal information your first name your last name your email your citizenship your country of residence 
okay your educational level guys whether you have a secondary school level a bachelor's degree whatever certificate or degree you have please put it it could be bachelor it could be a certificate program you have or it could be a trade or apprenticeship maybe you've learned a skill maybe barbing or tailoring and you have that certification master's doctorate whatever your situation is guys everyone is accepted your work experience have you had work experience in agriculture construction education healthcare and so on and so forth take your time to read it and if your profession or your qualification or your experience is not there just click on others if you click on others then you will specify what your occupation is all right it's very easy then the next thing is to upload your cv guys as you can see that most of this information they are basic information but your cv is not basic your cv has to be very very good guys look at this thing they wrote on that it says please make sure to download these cv templates and upload your cv in this format they've even given you a guide on how your cv should look like i was able to download this template and i'm going to show you in a minute what it looks like now the next thing is your language have you taken a language proficiency either yes or no and if english is your first language most of us in africa english is our first language okay that is our lingua franca you can click no english is my first language notes for immigration purpose you may still be required to submit proficiency exam results so if you speak english in your country if it's an english speaking country you can choose the second option all right and if you've taken maybe ielts before you can click yes then the same for the french if you've taken french proficiency exam either you click no yes if french is your first language in your country please click no french is my first language okay what questions you have about living in newfoundland and labrador guys i want to encourage you to feel something don't just leave this thing blank what you can do or if i were you i would just go to google research on newfoundland and labrador once you've done your research if there are certain things about the province that you're not clear about or you need more clarification you can write it as questions okay please don't leave it blank that's just my advice so you have up to three questions next thing says what are you hoping to gain from attending this virtual event please put in your responses all right and it says why this is not a requirement to upload your resume we do recommend that you upload a recent and detailed resume this will assist in connecting with an employer who holds an open vacancy for which you are eligible to apply applicants are encouraged to follow the attached cv template okay disclaimer any uploaded resume will be shared with eligible employers guys one of the most important thing of this application is your cv guys don't joke on it though please make sure you do your cv very well make sure it's top notch now let's look at the cv template that they gave us here okay so guys this is the cv template i will also link so guys this is the cv template it's very easy to get this template once you open the link on the form you can easily download it guys i want to show you something look at this cv template that is here and the video i did on canada cv templates what is the difference you can see it's the same thing guys this is to show that i have done my research i have connected with you know people in canada and they've been able to give me the secret how you can tailor your cv this cv template is similar to the one i did in that video you can even go watch that video again and see how i did that cv template It's the same thing with this template that newfoundland and labrador is giving to us okay so make sure you use this template for your cv and once again if you want me to help you review your cv i offer that services but we are going to use this canada cv template to make that cv to ensure that it is top notch because i want you guys to get this job i want a situation where once your cv is being shared with the eligible employer you stand a high chance of getting a job please don't sleep on this all right so once you've finished everything you've uploaded your cv you filled all the required form the next thing is that you click i am not a robot once you click i am not a robot you submit 
so that is it guys i've successfully shown you how you can go about the application process sure you tidy up your cv fill in the boxes correctly put in the right information don't make mistake take your time you submit and let's wait for the 25th of october 2023 and guys i wish you the very best make sure you always say a word of prayer to your application before you submit it okay we need the grace of god in everything we do and don't forget to share this opportunity to people that you feel they might need it okay have you gotten value from today's video and do you want to see more content like this the only way you can get it is to subscribe to my channel and turn on your notification bell okay so when i drop more value-based video you will be the first to be notified and don't forget to like this video guys please when you like it eh youtube can show it to more people you know in this family we don't want to be stingy we want everybody to have equal opportunities it is equality right okay so please like this video like all my videos and share it to everyone okay and guys i'm gonna see you in my next video bye